Ford F-350, because I keep my gun and all my ammunition in the exact same lockbox. Toyota Sienna, because your child is terrified of the changing rooms at Dorney Park, so I guess we're walking all the way back to the van so that you can change and put on your SpongeBob swimming trunks. Dodge Ram, my favorite episodes of the Joe Rogan experience are about the morality of hunting. Hyundai Sonata, if Fight Song by Rachel Platten were a car. Ford Fiesta, for blasting your woman by White Town at cookouts to which you weren't invited. C-Max Hybrid, the official car of being really into that girl in your gender studies class who won't shut up about your carbon footprint. Nissan Murano, because even Ford Nationals is just a stop along the way to picking up Brian from band practice. Car parts from a swap meet, because like girlfriends and sexually transmitted diseases, I'm always getting mine from someone else. <sighs> cashing in his money in the bank contract to steal yo girl. I love going to places like this and ordering a hot tea. I mean, they just look at you like you just asked to get your asshole licked. Hmm. I don't know how, but I want you inside me. Hi, I'm here to pick up my nephew, Joey. Yeah, my name's Ed. Yeah, Ed Colson. It should be on the name of Allowed Contacts. What do you mean I'm not... Alright, is it the mustache or the fact that I was just blasting fog hat? Florida man escapes law enforcement by decking his Mustang in law enforcement decals. I swear, this is like a key party where only couples who drive Mustangs were invited. Ah, uh, there really is nothing like a good old-fashioned stang and bang. Let's hit the beach, yeah! We're gonna be young forever! Mercury Marauder. Do you want to go to Boscov's? Because I'm pretty sure that's the only place this car will take you. Let's go try on pants. Scheduled a visit with my doctor, GP, because I'm spilling sweat like oil, BP. When am I doing it nationals? Easy, I'm looking for affordable pricing on a GT. GMC Acadia. You know, it's pretty rare for me to see you parked anywhere that isn't the outside of a Barnes & Noble. Oh, shit. It's an Edsel. Abject failure never looked so handsome. Yep. Man, a cougar this nice and clean almost makes me understand mecrophilia. It's the eye of the fair lane, it's the thrill of the Ford, rising up to the challenge of a Wrangler. On a long enough timeline, I think Pennsylvanians would even try to LS swap some deep fried Oreos. This color scheme really makes me crave saltwater taffy. Venison burgers, elk hot dogs, America.